welcome back everybody to Funky the Star TV. Um, you know, I want to say that um, all these things when they happen in the APC camp, including PDP camp, when the politicians they will come and they claim that they won't react, they won't react. For example, this thing will happen in Joss, where they tell us, see, uh, APC people, they met their Waterloo in Joss. Because where they go, they campaign, their Wayo campaign, the people, when they pay money, he made them come represent them there, made them come, you know, stay there as their supporter. They come they say, no, we are tired of this nonsense. We don't want this thing anymore. We don't want APC anymore. Before you know, they begin fire them with stone and different objects. Inside the campaign ground, remember the one that happened in Kogi State when uh, nobody know where bees enter their campaign ground. Come they fire them up and mama so everybody when attend that fake rally in Kogi State, everybody scamper because of the bees when attack them. And this is to show you that even the uh, uh, bees have rejected APC. Now, then go say me then go do campaign in Joss. Now him then meet with what they call their Waterloo. People begin stone them like never seen before. So when things like this happen, even Bola Tunubu shaky shaky matter. When we say not if he raising hand, I feel they raise hand. They, you know, if he hang that hand up, the thing will still fall. Um, this is not a matter of reaction because most of the time when they see where they talk, say APC or PDP, they react on what thing happen. Like this one, I tell us, say uh, Ruben Abati react as PDP mock APC over crowd throwing object at Joss campaign. Um, it is not going to be about reacting anymore because this Bolatunbu matter is a very, very serious and delicate matter. All of us don't see what can happen in this Buhari matter when they would, would, they never still know how they want to pull their head off when they can't kind of expose them. And at the end of the day, they're not going to bring out the charges. See, they can't kind of talk, say Buhari don't die because they don't want making make can kind of spill. Making exposed that is scatter everything on top of their table. So that is why they quickly and silently put that matter for one corner. They're not near there. Manami cannot go there at all. I not go area. APC people, nobody will feel near that statement again because they are very, very scared of man the camera. Because if they try and I see the time bomb will explode. That is why you see today the Murphy talk the matter on. Saying none, they can't say Buhari don't die in 2017. And they're not charged and put for any charge. So if Malami saying head day one million, making charging none, they come on that. Whether that board did there for him to come out and say none, they can't say Buhari don't die in 2017. Because they know it is true. That is why they are not going there. Because they know if they go there, remember. Uh, the major thing when APC get against Namdekano for exposing see the Abuhari don't die. And now the major Matana, they can't scrap them. They're not put them for inside their charges. They begin to talk about terrorism. They say they see, like, see, they see Namdekano with the bomb or they kill people somewhere in the north or in the south or in the west. Nothing like that. So the same matana they won't come carry on Bola Tunubu and people keep on saying and then they react. This one react, this one react, that one react. The level don't pass about reacting. Stop reacting and pull action on the subjects people are presenting. The subject be say Bola Meri Tunubu na paralyzed man. And we don't want Bola Meri Tunubu. Nigerian people don't need a sick man to come and represent them again in Asorok or in the worst stage. 
the matter be see Bola Medi Tunubu is paralyzed. So stop reacting, pull action. Bola Tunubu have to step down. APC can choose another candidate that can represent Bola Medi Tunubu because Bola Medi Tunubu cannot do a thing for anybody. Once he enter today, next tomorrow, now London, and then go stay two years before he go come back again. Before you know, they don't do that, they are mago mago again. So, uh, Ruben Abati should stop reacting about uh, PDP mocking APC or APC mocking PDP, including Atiku Abubakar. All these people get a lot of uh, 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 something when uh, no good in their hands. So, this is not about uh, reacting anymore. This is about Pulling action. Stop reacting. Call on Bola Meri Tunubu. Ruben Abati is a journalist in the war for channel television. Then go call Bola Meri Tunubu himself. Not be when they call Meri Tunubu, you know go show, you know go even send his VP. These people are totally disrespecting Nigerian people. Most especially this Tunubu and Atiku Abubakar. They are disrespected. They never become president, ladies and gentlemen. And these are the reason why Funky did they talk the way when they talk. Pull action. Stop reacting. Stop saying that Tiko react or PDP react or uh, Wiki react to this. Do an action and justice so that the people will see. Because Nigerians are not going to live by reacting. On a comment or an issue. No, Nigerians are going to live by your action. When you are pulled. Now, so Nigeria go take move forward. Now they tell you say Tunubu not well. You they talk about or oh, maybe they stone them, they stone APC people in uh, their campaign ground. And they are talking about reacting. They are telling you I'm okay, but like, Tunubu not if you raising hand and hand they shake you. People will come and say they react. What are you reacting? You don't see the man, say this man will not be able to give you what you want. He will not even exercise any power when you get there. The people when go there are the Kabas again, the Northern people is running mate. Now them be the Boko Haram themselves. Now them bring Boko Haram come to Bono State. And the Bono State start functioning full time when the same person when be Bola Ameri Tunubu say running mate when in the in power as governor of Bono State. And Nigeria will say they don't want that one as well. But the Tunubu won't be say Tunubu no well. Tunubu no feel fine and they need to change him with all due respect. Now, the same Tunubu, the same old, old man, now they tell you with a dead brain, now they tell you, now say, now you go come, they won't impose and give you. Because APC don't brag, say, the election, nobody go take them from them. And the boy they don't tell me that Bola Tunubu in predict saying go win. So make on stop to the react, make on act. We need action, not reacting. Because sometimes when I the you know go through the news when they come from Nigeria, you see this one react, this one react, that one react, that one react. What are you reacting? Action. Now they want not be don't stop reacting on things. You know, so that they tell us, say, uh, then go this place where they go recently. And now Ruben, they react now, say, because they stone the APC people. Nobody want APC, likewise PDP. Nobody want them. Nobody want APC. Nobody want PDP. That is why the crowd then begins to stone them like never seen before. And they, the crowd said they will continue to stone APC and PDP wherever or not go. No wonder when they tell you, say, 15 terrorist organizations, nothing they won't bring come. So that the terrorist organizations will, tell, will, will, will help them disrupt the election completely. So that they will quickly call Bola Ahmed Tunubu. See, now you're in the election. And again, then they tell us the Buhari's hometown. It gets some uh, terrorist people, 16 terrorist people, uh, then they wanted by the police in the Buhari's town when they take, go kill some men and women in Buhari's town or village or, or city.
Hmm? Jumpin taulah. So bad. I wonder. All these things are something when they're supposed to prevent before it happen. After it happen, finish. Now, Buari will begin to look for terrorist people. They, so this would uh, cannot prevent this thing. Of course, they can prevent it, but they don't want to do that. Because that is the, 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 the terrorism is their sole agenda when they get in that country. So that they go to the excel, they go to the move forward. Do that, everybody go shut up, everybody go hide. Then use this thing to stock fears into Nigerian people's mind. Now fears now they put inside our mind because of these terrorist people. They know what they are doing. So then they claim, say Buhari won't go after uh, 16 terrorist uh, uh, people when they go kill people in uh, Daura. Whereas Nahim they sponsor them. Whereas now then they import them. Now then they bring them, come now then they give their arms and their ammunition. So if they talk about terrorists, uh, Buhari, we, we, they find them, then they wanted, then do this and that. All now, why you ladies and gentlemen? All. How are you? Because the same APC people, now then tell us, say, then welcome Boko Haram. They won't help Boko Haram. Then they give them houses. Then they give them houses. They give them money. They give them food. The Boko Haram and their families, ladies and gentlemen. And also, after that, then we still leave them inside the city so that then we begin to live with other Nigerian people in the community. Terrorist people. When donkey scores, bomb churches, bomb mosque, hmm? enslave people, take all kinds of ransom from Nigerian innocent citizens. Nahim Buhari, they integrate. Uh, Nahim, then they welcome. They give them houses. Houses, ladies and gentlemen. Not the apartment, too. Houses, now they give them. And at the end now, they will come and tell you, see, oh, Boko Haram, they go uh, keep people for Buhari's town, hometown. The same people went in the help. In talk, see, if you touch Boko Haram, now you see, now him, you touch. The same person. So why Buhari, they claim, say he won't find uh, 15 terrorist people won't come kill uh, some people in his hometown. No makes sense now. Somebody when you don't you don't welcome them. Now you they bring them come. Everything now you they don't. Eh? And now you claim so you they find them. How possible? So now the problem we'll get in Nigeria with that. Hmm? Now the problem when we get when American people talk the thing, Nigerian government say na lie. But today now they tell you now see 15 terrorists so they don't kill in but nigerian government tell you saying a lie america they don't know what they talk there is a trouble man it's a trouble for the nigerian people now back to the campaign ground where they go stone apc people nobody want these people again if bola made the tunubu win election na rigging if atiku win election na rigging And the we the Nigerian people we no go accept that. Make we just the token now because election na February. The election don't reach na February next year here. And it can't be like see their campaign not come hot like the one when they campaign in 2019. So people no one APC again. And now the anger when they show them now see look we don't want to now. Uh -huh. In case you are rig, we know say na rig no na rig the election. Bola tunubu APC win election. We know say na rig. Make we just the talker now, because there's no how and no country will open their eye and let a drug dealer or a terrorist or a money launderer, when no money launderer, when no drug dealer, international drug dealer, to become a president of a nation. Impossible. So now the problem, the APC people, they are in trouble everywhere, including PDPO. Uh -huh. But we will come to PDP people later. Ladies and gentlemen, I see now here I will stop this particular segment. We will never forget to subscribe. We will never forget to the toss up, to the comment. 
any year we won't comment come comment we welcome all kinds of comments whether good or bad i don't forget now this particular um news platform where you will always get the truthful thing based on what that happened in nigeria okay one love everybody i'll see you guys next time funky d worldwide